I was born and raised in the same geographical range with Herola, so I see it as my next relative. Straddling the notoriously violent Somali-Kenyan border lives one of the most endangered species in the world. Dr. Abdullahi Ali is the founder of the Hirola Conservation Program. His work spans over 6,700 square kilometers along the border covering Garissa and Lamu County and extended into Somalia, where Hirola are now thought to be extinct. I work in a very remote and uh, volatile area, pretty intimidating uh, situation. As Hirola occur along the border, previous conservation efforts had been limited to opportunistic field visits. Past Hirola conservation efforts were also led by outsiders. Me, as a local, I wanted to change this and drive a vision that's well-grounded, uh, well-rooted and locally supported. Although poaching plays a role, it's largely loss of habitat that's causing the demise of this grassland-dependent species. By working with communities in Somalia and Kenya to restore grassland habitat, the Hirola Conservation Program is bringing the species back from the brink. We are engaging uh, the communities and uh, helping them participate in every single process we do. Their anti-poaching efforts employ local people as rangers dedicated to saving the Hirola antelope. With the support of WFN, it will allow us some continuity in the recovery of this species. With his Whitley Award, Ali will strengthen methods to monitor herds, introduce new systems to prevent livestock overgrazing, and restore protected habitat. There's nothing like Hirola. So it's something not to imagine or to think of losing this globally endangered species.